Hello to you, it's Meg, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I have another Macari Japan haul for you. As you can see, this package is quite large. It is the biggest one I've ever received from Neo Kyo. There are quite a bit of albums in here, and half of the stuff in here is not mine, it's Maddie's, but I'm still gonna open it as if everything is mine because I push it all off to the side anyways. But yeah, this box is huge. I just wanted to let you know. It barely fits into frame, as you can see. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Look at just, like, oh my god. That's crazy. Okay, let me sort everything out. Can we just take a moment to look at my desk? It is ruined. <laughs> well, okay. It's actually, like, a board. So... Yes, I will be getting a new one because that's so sad. Oh well, well, hopefully it doesn't bother you too much. While I was unwrapping some things, I saw some things that I am very intrigued about. <laughs> um, and I'll explain when I get there. I think I sorted almost everything out, but like I said, half of this stuff is not mine. So there were a few things that I wasn't too sure about if they were mine or not because I couldn't tell from the outside packaging but let's start with the first thing so oh my gosh I'm also going to start with the photo cards first and work my way up to the albums because there are quite a bit of both actually okay so first up I have Taeyeon's Hoot uh Japan card I believe yes her Japan tour card it is slightly transparent We'll put her there. And then I also have two of her Run Devil Run ones. I don't know what I'm going to do with the second one, but like I was looking at this one on a different listing and then I found this listing with both and it was only like 20 cents more or something. So I don't need both, but I now have both and they're very cute. So I did decide to start collecting more of her merch. I am not like following any wish list mainly because this girl has so much merch that it's hard to follow a wish list but I if I see things that I know are like legit and aren't that expensive I will buy them okay so next up I hate when it's there's no top loader because I'm so scared I'm gonna bend the card so next up I have another Yua Bon Voyage card this is the last card I wanted I really just wanted her sunflower set because like look look how precious and like the little flower on her face ah! okay and then next up we have an eyes wide open card and if you know twice colors you know who this is okay i think i got her yes So here we are. So here is Sana from the yellow set. It's so pretty. <gasps> Yay. Oh my god, I'm so happy. I actually bought this before I decided to collect twice. So, okay, so this is a card where I don't know what it is, but I do think it's mine. So, actually, I think I know what it is just by like process of elimination. Yeah, it is. I, I'm peeking inside and seeing. Ah! As I was saying, I could see it. Okay, so I'm not collecting this card, but I am collecting this card. And again, I bought these before I decided to collect twice. So this one will be up for trade, which I think it actually will be up for trade for Jewie's yellow card because I'm pretty sure I misplaced the trade and by that I mean like I marked it off as on the way when it's not on the way because I can't find the DM for it so I'm gonna wait a little bit but this card will probably only up for the yellow card for Jewy so this next one is technically mine but technically not so I'm just gonna show you it anyways and then they wrote a really cute little note I love Japanese handwriting it's so cute oh wait there's like stickers they're like little woodland stickers that's so cute so there's like a leaf and a bear a couple bears strawberry cake oh my god this one's adorable i'm gonna put them off to the side but yes so I'm 
Oh my gosh. <laughs> so, yes, this Stana card, which is double sleeved, that's amazing. So, yes, so I once again bought this before I decided to collect twice, and I traded off my Jiho one because I honestly am not the biggest fan of this set. I love Sana's, but I don't like the other two girls' ones. Not that I don't like the girls, obviously. I just don't like, I don't know, I just. So I bought this and then I found out Maddie had a card I needed. So I was like, you can have this card. So yeah, okay. So then we have the last of the like loose photo cards. Well, kind of. So this thing is very exciting as well. You can tell by the back. Okay, so we have two of Tan's. Oh yeah, or well, not two, but we have some of Tan's tour cards. Um, do this, and then here is the other one for this set, and then these ones, stunning. And then the last one. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy to have more tan merch. All right. So yeah, so that's all of like the photo cards. So let me start opening the albums now. Okay, so the first one, I'm just going to kind of blindly grab them because yeah. Oh gosh, of course. It is bubble wrapped. Okay. So, I have All My Girls Atoli slash Nonstop. I believe this is the normal edition. I wasn't too sure because on the listing, they didn't show the front. They only showed the inside. So, oh, it's cracked. Oh, well, that's okay. So, it did come with the one of the postcards, which it did come bent. I don't know if you can kind of see that. Big sad, but I'll get over it. And then... It, oh my god, it, good thing that should be an easy fix. I don't think it's because it broke. I think it just, hold on, okay. Ah! Oh no, it's broken. It's broken at the top. What? <laughs> Anyways, so I got Sungi's CD plate and then I also got one of her photo cards with it, which I am going to be collecting these photo cards because they are adorable and they're actually like nine pocket and I mean, I did decide to collect her, most of her merch stuff anyways, and her Japanese stuff, so, yes. Okay, so let's look at the few pictures. So there's one, there's one, and then, yes. All right, very cute. Sad that it's broken, but it's just gonna sit on my shelf anyways, so. Oh boy. Okay, this next one is the one I was kind of like talking about where I was like, this is interesting. I'm going to have to go back and like look at the listing, but I don't remember it coming with this. So, as you can see, it is some Jewy cards with a hashtag twice um, album, which is one of their Japanese albums. Um, uh, yeah, okay, so, I thought it was just these cards, because these are her Twistagram cards, so, there are, there's this one, which is the yellow back, and then this one, which has, like, the Polaroid on the back, and then this one. So, yeah, I thought it was just these three cards, but um, it came with an album, apparently. <laughs> so, I mean, I'm not mad. Oh my god, so cute. Oh my god, look at Sana. I just thought it was funny that they included it. Thank you. <laughs> uh, I don't know what to say. I mean, I'm glad I got my cards, at least. I was a little confused when I pulled it out, and I only saw, like, this one. So I was like, um... Did they just include it as, like, a freebie, or did they, like, was that actually the listing? We'll find out afterwards, as I do for most things. Okay, and then the next one is pretty, well, actually, okay, let's stay on the twice train. So, this, uh, 
so I have Toys's Feel Special. I don't remember which version this is, but it is the version that I wanted. So it comes with Sana's CD plate and Mina's like um, lyric book. And then it comes with um, all six photo cards. So we have Daehyun's uh, gold card, which I don't like I'm not gonna collect my biases for these I might not even keep it we'll see and then I have this Che card and then this Che card and then this card which is so pretty I love the border and then we also have two Sana cards so we have her flower one which this is the set I am collecting I'm also collecting this set but obviously I'm not collecting Che's um, and then we have Sana again. So yes. So then if we quickly flip through. Oh my god, I love this concept so much. This is my favorite era title track. It's my everything. I love this era so much. Ah, yay, I'm so happy to have it now. The next album. I probably will have to open off camera because it looks like it's going to be a pain to get into. Okay, so it is secret number, so I have one of the banners, which I already have one, but then it also comes with a poster, which I didn't know that. Well, maybe I did, and I just forgot, but let's look. Oh my god, I think I did actually know. Look how cute! <gasps> Yay! Okay, so I want to see something before... I show you the photo card because the photo card was on the outside so I want to see if it came with the postcard oh yes oh it came with Sudoms okay so there is the postcard and the stickers I've already showed this off on camera I believe before so I'm not gonna flip it through it again but the reason why I ended up buying this was because it came with Denise's photo card and I have been having, well, I was having the hardest time finding her Who Disc photo cards. I have got that boom complete, but I literally could not find this card anywhere. And it was extremely cheap for what I paid and everything I got. So I'm not upset. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. So I technically have her complete. I just have a trade lined up. For her uh, other card that I need so yay oh my gosh so happy so the next albums are all shiny um, and there's quite a few so this is the first one and let us carefully get inside I totally forgot that this was like the big um, box set one <laughs> I did decide to start collecting all of Shiny's Japanese albums, so, but I'm mostly doing the limited. I'm not doing the normal for the most part. It depends. Oh, hello, Minho. <laughs> so yeah, here's his photo card, which is why I chose this one. Look at how cute the backs are. I love the back of Japanese cards, but as I was saying, I'm not really getting the normal ones unless there aren't really or unless there's a good difference between the normal and the limited because a lot of the normals like don't have photo books so yes but this one literally has like the play button which is similar to like a kino kind of thing oh what <gasps> wait oh my god wait no it's not what what i've never seen one of these Okay, so I'm assuming you plug in your headphones and then play it. There's a safety pin that's so weird. I kind of want to try it out. Hold on. I don't know if it works. <laughs> I was under the impression it was similar to a Kino. Well, I mean, I guess it technically is, but okay. Hold on. Okay, it doesn't work. <laughs> I didn't think it would, but I could be doing something wrong. But yes, that's so funny that that's like that. I think one of my other albums was supposed to have a play button and it just didn't include it. I'm not too sure, but there it is. Okay. And then we have the CD and DVD set. 
And then lastly, the photo book, which is actually pretty big for it being only a single, as you can see. But, oh my god, it's pretty... Hold on, let me move Minho out of the way for safety. Okay, but... Yes, I loved this concept. Oh, yay. I've really been into missing shiny hours lately, especially because, like, they're posting all the time. And I'm just like, oh, my God, I forgot how much I miss them. And I'm just so happy they're back. When I'm filming this, like, the night before they announced their comeback live, that, like, where they are going to perform and also spoil the new song and everything or like the new the comeback and i'm just i'm so so excited to especially since i'm collecting ot5 again oh my god i can't wait okay so next up we have lucky star which as you can see the photo card is on the outside well technically so let me let me rescue it okay so yeah, I got Minho's again. I love how his name is spelled out in apples. Oh, I love this card so much. He looks so good. Okay, so let me show you the full effect real quick first. So yeah, here's the, the front and then the back. And it is the limited version, of course. So it has the CD and the DVD. Is that a guide on how to do it? That's hilarious. Oh yeah, that's so funny. That's a weird way to do it. Okay. And then the photo book. I love this concept so much. Like, oh my god. Look. Wait, am I wrong? I thought this came with a postcard. Maybe I'm thinking of the one of the other albums I got. Oh, I think I am. Okay. Um, sometimes I find three, like, the same listing multiple times. Or similar listings where they're, like, all the same price, but they include different things. So I forget the ones I actually end up getting. Because I am not collecting their postcards, but I am collecting their, or Minho solo cards. And I did recently decide to collect the group cards for Japanese albums so because I eventually will be on my way to collect OT5 Japanese stuff but I kind of want to make progress on both my Minho collection first and my um like OT5 sets first okay so we have Sherlock again the limited edition I know some of these have A and B versions and I don't know which one is which but I know that normally there's like a limited A and it's like a DVD version and then limited B is just a Blu-ray instead. So, but I love the like 3D aspect of the cover. Okay, so again, here is the CD and DVD. And then we have the limited photo book, which again, it has... Minho's. Oh my god, so cool. The Japanese cards, like, the fronts are always interesting because they're, like, mostly concept photos, but, like, the backs are just so pretty, so I can't resist them. But we have the photo book. Oh my god. Hello, Jong. <laughs> oh yeah, this concept. Oh, Sherlock, you were, you were something. Here, let me put these back. Okay, so just two more albums and then we'll be done, I promise. Okay, so this next one is a jewel case, but I promise it is, ah, it is a limited version because this album only comes with jewel cases. I am collecting all three of them because um, all of them have different photo books. So yes, we have Shiny's 321. Oh, again, I don't know if this is the limited A or B, but it does have the CD and the DVD. I keep putting everything out of frame. I'm so, so sorry. But it should have... Yep. Oh, they put it in his sleeve. <gasps> Wait. Oh, my God. It came... With... 
is that it's a sticker oh my god maybe that's what i'm thinking of when i was talking about the postcard but yes this has minho's 321 card which this back is so interesting i know a lot of people who like this is their favorite set and i find it funny but okay oh key look oh my god i love it yes oh my god i'm so excited i made so much progress today all right the last album which is personally one of my favorites if not my favorite well i have an actual favorite japanese title but i feel like this is a close a close second so we have dazzling girl which is very long as you can see <laughs> so but oh, let me show the back first okay so we have oh oh okay this is the one that comes with the postcard look at him he is stunning oh wait this is that is a printed photo <laughs> i don't know if it's legit or not i just remember it like being in the picture so and i was like you know what more minho things yes please but there is his card. I believe Dazzling Girl has two different photo cards. But then we open. Look at the photo. You can't really see because, you know, the camera is so small. But there is the CD and DVD. And then this is like technically the photo book. They're just postcards. So we have this one with the lyrics on the back. And then Onu, like, this is what I mean. Like, look at this concept, which should have, oh, it has a group slash unit on the back. Yeah, a unit. And then Jong, oh my god, look at him. Ah, look at him. And then it came in. And then my boy Minho. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, I'm getting too excited. And then we have Ki. Oh my, oh my god, these next ones. So we have Onu again. Oh my god, look at all the photos. And then Jong. He's so sweet looking. Oh my gosh. He was ripped this era, Jesus. <laughs> and then our little Macne. Oh, I love this photo. <laughs> and then Minho, who is always ripped. Oh my gosh. Yes. And then lastly, key. Oh my gosh. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so that was everything that I received in my New Yorkio package today. It took me forever to get through it, but we did it. I am so happy with the progress I made today. I can't wait to put everything away. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching and I will see you next time. Bye.